All right, you guys, before we do anything else today, I need to speak to you from the future. Yes, I know this is a little bit startling. Don't look around too much. Don't look around too much. There may have been a lot of things going on in our old friend's dog sanctuary. I am speaking to you from the future because the future is also now. And my friends, we have an amazing announcement. We have our very own old friend's dog game sanctuary merchandise. What the heck? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so basically, if you guys go ahead and update your old friend's dog game today, and then you go into the market and scroll on down, dun 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 dun, to the claim coupon codes here. And guys, if you go ahead and you put in Siri Pixel just right there, you can go ahead and claim your very own, your very own gift. It is your very own brand new, absolutely freaking adorable doggy planter. An exclusive doggy planter that goes with our community. Oh my gosh, I am so happy right now. This is so awesome. I can't believe this. Oh my goodness, I'm so tickled. So they reached out and said they really loved our community. They loved what we've been doing in our old friend's dog game. And they offered to give us our own exclusive coupon code where if you go ahead and update your game and you enter that, you can get this adorable doggy planter that you can get nowhere else. You have to put in the Siri Pixel code just like I showed you. And then you too can add a little bit more greenery to your wonderful life with your old doggy friends. So I'm going to go ahead and put this into the intro of the next video. Cough, cough. I am speaking to you from the future, from the future, from the future. And we're going to now resume our adventures in Old Friends Dog Game. But I am so tickled about this. I hope you will tell all of your friends that you can come in and you've got the scoop on how to get an exclusive planter to go ahead and add into the game. And I, I swear, now I want to like remake this planter in real life. And I'm just glowing and beaming with joy and I hope that our puppers are going to love this too. So all right let's dive into today's adventure and then I hope you guys are looking forward to uh, catching up with us so you can meet some new friends pretty soon. Ah, but those are in future episodes so let's carry on friends and do please let me know send pictures like Go ahead and alert me on Twitter and Instagram and all of those amazing places on our Discord if you're one of our patrons of being able to put this planter in here because I, I, I honestly think I'm like walking on clouds right now and I- Where's my joy journal? Alright, I gotta get my joy journal guys. Okay, enjoy. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Old Friends Dog Game, where I have great news! Both Mac and our adorable Beagle Bagel have stories to tell us. We have been very busy in the background here, sweeping up all of the leaves, cleaning up all the little piles of dirt that fall down. I've actually collected a lot of stuff that we could potentially use for, like, crafting some new items. Like, I have a whole bunch of nails, I have a whole bunch of fabric scraps, and some wood now. I'm not exactly sure sure like what I want to build this box bed is really cute oh my goodness like I'm not exactly sure like what I want to make when it comes to looking at some of the other things that we could put around the house until we get to the plants I really 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 hope we can start finding some uncommon seeds and some uncommon wood and rocks so that we can hopefully make a really freaking adorable set of plants to just put absolutely everywhere that would make me delighted uh, but it looks like we need to level up up to unlock a lot of the other ways to decorate and I think we might need to level up in order to go ahead and unlock getting the rare seeds and the uncommon items so without further ado we're gonna go ahead and we're before we talk to them actually let's give pets what am I thinking without further ado we need to give pets all right let's go ahead and give pets to both Mac there you go Mac and to Bagel the Beagle and then I think you actually level up by going ahead and doing these live streams. So we're going to go ahead and do another live stream with the puppers. And once we complete that, then hopefully we can really start making some great advancements and transforming the senior dog sanctuary into something special. All right, let's do this, you guys. Okay, we're going to have Mac and we're going to have uh, Bagel or Beagle the Bagel. Or Bagel the Beagle. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And then we're going to go ahead and give them maybe some uncommon treats and let's give them the uncommon ball and let's go ahead and start streaming and hopefully that will make them super duper happy. Alright, here we go. 
They look so cute with their little celebration outfits on. I love it. All right, all right, all right, give food. Give food, got it, got it, got it. Give toy, give toy, got it. All right, Mac, you're up next. Mac, there we go. We gotta give some pets. Also, Mac, for you, and then toy for you. Okay, Oh, this is, why is this so much fun? You just really have to keep an eye on trying to get those, like, delightful combos. All right, there we go. Give a little pet, give some food, give a toy to Bagel. There we go. All right, food and then toy. And then we need food. And then it looks like we need food. Oh, this is so cute. I love the idea that, like, chat's just going wild. And they're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, Matt, go. Go, Matt, go. Oh, my gosh. If I ever get, like, real-life puppies, I wonder if you guys would react like this if we had a stream. Like, yeah, donate so much and you can go ahead and give them a treat, but I would probably have to put a limit on that. Oh my gosh. All right, so let's claim the donations. And look at that! New recipes are now available in the kitchen. Huzzah! So I do think that's how you, like, formally level up, is by gaining fame through your live streams. And it looks like we're making good progress. Yeah, look at that! Because if you click on the level up, then I guess, like, the idea is you can actually try to level up sooner than that. It's just a little harder. So we might actually try to do that today and see if we can get to level 5 a little faster. Uh, but first thing, how did Earth... <laughs> okay, this is just like real life live streaming where you turn around and you're like, how did my room become so messy in, like, just a couple hours? Alright, well, let's clean all of that up. Let's gain a whole bunch of these treats. Uh, let's go ahead and see... <gasps> oh, silver material chest! Earn stars from completing requests. Pet any dog or dogs 60 times. We did that. Hi there. Oh, it's Noah. How's Bagel doing? I found this scarf at the rescue shelter, and I think I might it might help him settle in his new place. You can have it if you give any of your dogs at least 20 pats for me. Totally done. Bagel's doing okay. Still getting to know the place. Thank you for asking, and thank you for the scarf. Bagel will look adorable in it. Yay! We got a few things from the Barket earlier today. There we go. And the donations totally go to the dogs, don't worry. We played a few dog streams, so Paris is happy. Give That all gave us some money, and now we can open up this chest. What? From completing all those requests? That's pretty cool. Oh, hey, that's how we get the uncommon fabric. <gasps> and some stones! I might be able to start making some, um, some like, beautiful little plants at this point. That would make me very happy. This whole place needs to be covered in plants. And speaking of covering the place in plants, we are still doing our best to go ahead and try to complete a whole bunch of these ticket items. Uh, let's see. Complete one wolf's up request. Get two new dog costumes. Start baking great treats. We completed a whole bunch of those. Post 10 vlogs on your dog vlog, because we are trying really hard to achieve as many of these tickets from the live or the launch update as possible, because there's the coolest little launch celebration going on, and I really, really, really do want to be able to go ahead and try to get this ridiculously hilarious statue. I have no idea how I could rebuild this in zoo crafting, but I kind of want to because it's so ridiculously hilarious. Um, maybe I could try to rebuild it like in Sims 4 too. Because it's just, I mean, look at this thing. Mossy. It's got a little pug. Oh, it's adorable. All right, let me go and look at the raffle. I don't think I want to risk the raffle. I think I want to just go ahead and uncover a bunch of these things. So let's actually uncover two spots today. <gasps> Who's this, Puppers? Oh, all right. I can't wait to earn more tickets. Play donation live stream, three donation live streams. Okay, so there's actually a lot you can do every day to try to unlock those things, um, including the dog blog post. All right, let's check this real quick. All right, rescue second dog. Learn how to craft furniture. Now we need to rescue a third dog, and that will actually help us out. Um, and to rescue a third dog, we need to make progress with Bagel's story. So let's see how his story is going to go from here. You casually wander into the yard. Hmm, could do with a good tidy up. I will say it needs more plants. Oh, Bagel, are you a little crafting pup? You walk over to the shed when you hear a strange scratching noise. Hello? The scratching sound continues. Sounds like it's coming from the fence line. All right, time to investigate. You take a closer look. There's nothing here. Chipmunk? Bravely, you continue your search along the fence. Wait, is Bagel- <gasps> Bagel, are you getting out of here? Uh-oh. Suddenly, you come across a suspicious pile of dirt. Is something buried there? Your mind wanders to those true, those true crime broadcasts you listen to. That took a very dark turn. 
With much courage, you prod the dirt with your shoe. There's nothing but dirt. Uh, maybe I should listen to something else from now on. The hunt is on. Time to find what's been digging up the yard. That's adorable. We need to give him his little bandana. You wander further along the fence line and see a dirty looking beagle. That doesn't surprise me because beagles uh, were bred to chase rabbits. Bagel? Oh, he's so cute. Yay, we got a new dog blog post. Oh, why is that so adorable? I love that. I need to start mimicking that for a lot of our animals in all of our other series. Like, and just posting those like on our community tab and Instagram and stuff. That'd be cute. You see a large hole dug under the fence. Well, it might be why. Maybe Bagel's just used to wandering around and confused by having a fence. Looks like Bagel's trying to escape. Um, let's try coaxing him to us because I think that actually maybe let's fill the hole, but maybe Bagel, I, I don't want to scare him and dogs are a lot more intelligent than you would think. But if I try to coax him and he's trying to escape, fill the hole! In a state of panic, you jump forward to fill the hole. Uh-oh. The hole is filled. The bagel won't be able to leave now. Phew, that was a close one. Oh no. Did he, like, run away while I wasn't looking? Where did bagel go? Did I just chase bagel away? Oh, he's scared. He's back in his corner. Oh, let's give him a treat. See, in this place, uh, I'm a friend, bagel. Bagel gobbles up the treat. There we go. Poor guy. He's just nervous. He seems content after his treat. He promptly rolls over and goes to sleep. Good idea. I need a nap, too. Oh, Well, I'm really, like, on the one hand, you think you could logic your way through things and be like, oh, no, the puppy will understand. He'll know that I'm not big and scary. But on the other hand, actually, no, the puppy won't know that. And you probably need to go ahead and just kind of be bold. Uh, hey, Bagel, let's get all those hearts ready to go, Bagel. All right, how many hearts do you already have? Oh my holy moly! Good to know! So you actually can continue to get a bunch of their hearts even after they, um, even after they hit like a story quest. Okay, that's very good. Because I think Bagel's actually really close. Yeah, just 211 to the next story quest. And he has a new wardrobe thing. Look at him! He's all dressed up! Oh my gosh, if Chips and I ever do get puppies, um, I have a feeling I would end up decorating them out in a lot of stuff. It's, it's, I've been containing, like, I haven't had a pet in years now. I've been containing it for years. I think it would just burst into, a, like, a wardrobe for a puppy. Um, all right, let's see. Getting closer on his next heart. Good to see that you really do keep those hearts coming, even if you're trying to, like, wait for the story like I do, so I can share it with you guys. Good, good, good. Then what's going on? Oh, feed Bagel ten times! <gasps> and we get this little, this little present! Hi again! So I found this dog bed that someone upcycled from an old suitcase. Do you want it? I'm happy to give it to you in exchange for giving heaps of treats to that adorable beagle. If there's one thing I've learned about having a dog sanctuary, it's that you can never have enough beds. Oh, that's so cute! Absolutely! Beagle! Alright, he's full right now, but we'll, we'll work on feeding him over time. So that we can get that adorable bed and add it in here. And now, let's actually post the dog blog real quick. Oh, Bagel! Turns out Bagel is an escape artist. Cheeky boy. Hashtag more potholes. Yay! <laughs> oh, why is this so cute? Alright, so that's done. Let's collect the donations. And then let's come and talk to our boy, Mac! Mac has awoken from a particularly long snooze. Hello, sleepyhead! Mac says hello! What should we do today, buddy? Um, let's look around the house for something to do. You look around the house for something to keep Mac occupied. Let's find some toys for him. He likes balls. And he's got his new friend! You search the house for something to play with and come across our new friend, Bagel! Mac gleefully sniffs, sniffs around his new friend. Uh, maybe be gentle, Mac, or maybe want to play Bagel. Let's sound really positive and happy. Want to play Bagel? Oh, we got a toy! Oh, my heart! Oh, this is too cute! Mac finds a toy and drops it in front of Bagel, hoping he'll have a playmate. The toy thuds on the ground, frightening Bagel. Oh, he's spooked. Bagel plods away to the other side of the room, watching cautiously from afar. Oh, Mac! Mac lays on the floor and sighs. He seems unsure about what he did wrong. Oh, let's reassure him. Don't worry, Mac. Bagel will warm up eventually. We just have to make sure he feels comfortable, okay? Mac's such a good boy. Oh my gosh. 
Ah, oh, my heart. I miss puppies so bad. And by puppies, I mean like all dogs. Um, and also cats. <laughs> and also my birds. I love animals. I can't believe we've gone this long without a pet. Uh, Mac stands up, tilts his head, and wanders off. I'm sure you'll be friends in time, Mac. I gotta stay positive. I'm not gonna tell Mac this is harder than I thought. Absolutely not. Keep my chin up. Not gonna let Mac feel discouraged. <gasps> He's already ready for another heart! No! Oh, I see! Okay, and now we need to get him to the next level of his little story. Mac, how many hearts did you have waiting? A lot! <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and give him pats. This is really cute. I love checking in on him just like over the course of the day. There we go. We'll give you a couple special treats. But I really do love checking in on them just like over the course of the day and kind of tidying things up. Just making sure like the holes are filled. There we go. Collecting all of their little hearts. Excellent! All right, we actually did a good job today, friends. I'm pretty happy with this. Look, and we have so many hearts. <gasps> I think we'll be able to go ahead, uh, give Woodstick to Mac two times, and then feed Mac with basic pumpkin. <gasps> what is this party macaroni? Honeybee Mac? Hey, I love your dog blog feed. Mac's is such a cute dog. I even chose my username after him. He would look so cute with this bee costume my dog used to have. I'll send it to you, but only if you give Mac loads of treats. I think he really deserves it. Thanks. Oh my gosh, you guys, that's freaking adorable. I love how you can unlock different outfits for them. And a basic pup cake six times. Well, if we're gonna pull that off, I think we should go ahead and finish the day off with a new stream to unlock the next level of life. I think we can do this. All right, we'll use fancy treats and fancy toy. And let's do this. All right, cheerful tales home. You guys ready? Okay, give toy to this bubbers. And feed this bumpers! And toy this bumpers! This bumpers! Alright, wait for it, wait for it. Okay, give toy. And feed. Good, good, good. Alright, I think we're doing okay. And now, we'll give pets. Give pets. Give treat. Oh, that was a big boost. And give pets. <laughs> and now, give pets. Alright, toy. Treat. Oh, this is so fun! Why is this so fun? It's because everybody loves the puppers, and that makes you really happy, because you're like, yes, everyone should love these doggos. Alright, oh, food, 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 go, 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 go. Alright, go, 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 treat. Pet. There we go. Pet, 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 pet. Yeah, pet, 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 pet. Yes! Okay, I think we definitely, yeah, we totally destroyed that stream. That's so awesome. Everybody is so happy because the dogs had such a great time, and they gave us some donations. Coin cap has increased. New recipe available in the workshop. Boom! So that's how you level up. I really like how there's kind of the interactive tone to leveling up, where if you want to level up, then what you need to do is go ahead and like try your best. Oh my gosh, Mac, you're already hungry again? Well, let's give you a basic pup cake. I do think I have a few of those. What? What? What do you mean I don't have a basic pup cake? All right, we're gonna go, oh, basic donut? <gasps> that's so cute. What, and I'm out of food. All right, we're gonna come in. I gotta buy a bit of food, and we're gonna start making a basic pup cake in the kitchen for our boy Mac, so that we can get him that adorable little bee outfit, because that's just so cute! All right, I'm really happy, I love this. I kind of wanna recreate this in zoo crafting now. Oop, gotta clean up that poop. But I do kind of want to recreate this in Zoocraft, or not Zoocrafting, uh, Sims 4, because I think it would be really fun. And we have unlocked the minimal garden path. Excellent. All right. This is exciting. But all right, guys, thank you so much for joining us on this adventure. If you guys could, do please leave a like for a Mac and for Bagel and for these pop cakes. And if you would like to join us on... Oh, Mac has a favorite treat. <gasps> what? Mac, my boy, he loves pup cakes. I never knew, and now we do. But all right, so if you guys could, do please leave a like for our wonderful senior dogs and this increasingly adorable little home. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, oh, if I could only make Mac that great pup cake. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, there you go, Mac. I'm going to feed you so many pup cakes. Bye-bye. <laughs>